What's going on, everybody? This is Kev Brown, Create Your Life Series, Vallejo Edition. Still here on my block. Happy to be here. Today's episode, we're going to talk about circumstance. Let's break that word down. Circum, which is a part of the word circumference, which means a continuous line, which is we consider to be a cycle. Then let's talk about stance, which comes from the word stand. So let's take that and put it together. We're going to take a stand against that cycle that's happening in our lives. Well, sometimes there's two different types of circumstances, those that hinder us and those that help us. So we're going to say that the law of attraction or what we focus on and what we do is actually what brings those different types of circumstances to us. So if we're focusing on the positive, then the positive is coming to us. If we're focusing on the negative, then the negative is coming to us. There will be some things in life that we can't control, so we might end up in a circumstance or two uh, that is out of our control. But guess what? A circumstance is usually something that's external. So therefore, we as people, as beings, have the power to change that. So I want to highlight one story, one circumstance that I actually had to take a stance on when I was growing up right here on this block. I was one of the younger kids, and so we used to play tackle football, you know, banging each other up against the cars and things like that all up and down the street almost every day in the summer or when it was warm enough outside. And I noticed that the older kids would actually be the all-time quarterbacks. But when people in the neighborhood would be walking back and forth, which would be um, drug addicts, sometimes prostitutes and things like that, they'd be walking back and forth. The older kids would be teasing them and talking about them. And then I noticed as we got older, the younger kids, those who became the all-time quarterbacks or who were the all-time quarterbacks, they soon became the very people that they were talking about. And so I had to take a stance. I wanted to take a stance against that cycle because I didn't want to be one of those people who Number one, I didn't talk about them. I just observed, but I didn't want to be someone who talked about a certain particular type of person later on to become that person in a negative aspect. So I had to take a stand there. Then there was also the stance against what happens with foster care children normally. You know, there's only 6% of us that graduate from college. We usually end up homeless and all these other negative things about foster care children. So that was another thing that I had to take a stance on. I had to stop that cycle for myself and now I'm doing work to stop that cycle, help others stop that cycle for themselves as well. So, you know, in life we have to take stands against these cycles that are happening. And sometimes we know that these cycles are going on and we just allow them to to bother us and stress us out or to continue on until we can't take it anymore and then we have an outburst or a blow up. So we want to prevent that. And so I want to give, leave you with three things, three ways to overcome any circumstance. Those three ways are going to be, number one, have a plan of what exactly you want to do. Number two, be courageous enough to carry out that plan. And lastly, number three, I want you to have faith and self-belief that you can carry out that plan because that faith is really, really, really what's going to help you when times get hard, when you feel like you don't have a a chance to to do it. When your mind is saying, ah, I don't know if I can do this. And you're saying to yourself, I have to, I have to, I have to. That's where that self-belief is going to come through and it's going to come in for you. So this is Kev Brown, Create Your Life Series, Vallejo Edition. I love you guys. You are the master of your faith. You are the captain of your soul. Create the life you want. I'm out.